Well, Keandra Reese is a therapist here at this school. She's a prevention coordinator. That's a job that deals with behavioral issues for at-risk kids. But Reese herself is accused of criminal behavior in a violent domestic assault. The Murray District says it put Keandra Reese on admin leave as soon as it learned she faced charges of object rape, aggravated assault, and domestic violence in the presence of a child. I mean, if that's true, should that person have anything to do with youth in crisis? No, I don't think so. April Despain ran and lost a race for Murray School Board and keeps tabs on the district. That's crazy. We only had one person's uh, story about what occurred. Detective Michael Ruff, Salt Lake Police, says at first the victim was not ready to talk to investigators. After the assault, did police contact the Murray District and say, hey, you know, a therapist, one of your own, was involved in this. So at the time this incident occurred, I'm not even sure if our officers knew where uh, this individual worked. A court document says the assault happened on August 10th with a responding officer saying he saw blood on the walls, the couch, the floors, and the rug. But the victim was not interviewed by police until three months after the assault. Charges were not filed until November 18th. So from August 10th until just before Thanksgiving, Reese was on the job. Even after charges, the Murray District did not widely notify parents. These parents should have been made aware. Police say the victim of the assault is an adult. As for the district not putting out a wide notification for parents, the district said we have no evidence or accusations from law enforcement or within our community that these incidents or similar conduct occurred during Ms. Reese's professional duties at MCSD. Attempts to reach Reese and her attorney not successful today. Live in Murray, Brian Malahi, KUTV2 News.